This video shows the process of creating a localization for a GPS job on site, i.e. if you're not working on a national grid coordinate system, or if your site coordinate systems are a pseudo national grid, or based on a simple 1000, 2100 origin point, for example. So the first thing we need to do is turn off any projections and geodes in the coordinate system. To do that, we go into config coordinate system. And when we have the projection and the geoid, we simply set to none. Confirm that with a green tick in the top right corner. We can then manually enter the coordinates of any stations we have on site. Let's click on edit points down to add enter your point ID or your point number of the station physical ground station on site and then we can key in the coordinates of our local station now these values can be simple 2000 1000 origin or they can be semi pseudo national grid coordinates it really makes no difference at this point so if you've got two or three points you can just continually enter the data um, repeat the process your point number increments automatically and we can enter as many points as we want on there. Ideally, we're looking at a minimum of three points to perform a, a robust localization. Once we have our control points or our station information entered, hit the home icon in the top right corner. We then go into setup, localization, add. So we have two options to enter points here. The first point at the top of the screen is our known point. It's the, the data that we've just selected. We can key in the point number, we can select the point from a map, or select the point from a list. We then need to measure a physical GPS position on that point. So give it a, a unique point ID. In this case, point 1000 GPS. Just so I know that point 1000 and 1000 GPS correspond to each other. You can then take a measurement on that point from physically standing with a detailed pull over it, leveled, ready to go. Once you get the message point stored, hit the green tick. And we see the point added to our localization. Just repeat the process for the, for the number of ground stations that you have on site. So go to add. Select my next station. Walk over to that point on site. Give them my unique correspondent point number. And take a measurement. Point stored. Just accept that. Hit the green tick. And then we start to see our residuals appear. So we've got our horizontal vertical residuals. And we simply repeat the process ideally for three points. The more the better. Once you're happy with the, the localization parameters, we can come out of that. Back to the home screen from the main menu. 
And then if we go into survey, topple, at the bottom of the topographic screen, what we should see is our local coordinate system. There we go, based on the data that we've entered. You can now continue to, with your um, survey or any staking out, setting out that's required.